Hello guys, how are you doing today? I hope it's good. Now I'm um, at the request of one of my subscribers, um, Shaftel. I'm making another video or series of videos of the uh, the long dark. Now my previous uh, set of videos on this game, um, the save file for those has disappeared. Um, I can't remember when that happened, but um, probably when I switched over to Windows 10, something, something, something. So anyway, I am going to jump in Mystery Lake here and we are going to set off in the Canadian wilderness again a fresh game a mysterious geomagnetic storm has brought your plane crashing down to the northern Canadian wilderness how long can you survive? He knelt among the shadows and felt his isolation bitterly. They were savages, it was true, but they were human. Lord of the Flies. Okay. So, here I am. Beginning in the forest. In the middle of nowhere. It's very cold, but it's the middle of the day at least. So I have plenty of daylight to work with. Which way, which direction do I head? I think I'm going to go this way. Now, I haven't watched my old videos, so there's going to be a whole number of things that have changed since last time I played, but I can't remember exactly what. Deadfall area. Now oh, we have a hatchet. That's a nice early find can break down large logs with that Grab these reishi mushrooms. Can make a tea from them with antibacterial properties. We have a lone deer. I'm not going to bother him. Not today. Mm. He has a friend. Frolicking. going to want to find some sort of shelter soon keep myself warm but whilst I'm outside I can grab a few sticks should I need to start a fire like 
someone else has met an untimely demise here. I wonder what the cause of this man's death was. Probably the cold. But why was he stuck out here? is always useful. like my guy is um, pretty cold. I should be looking to head in ASAP. Okay. Knife. And a crow feather. So we have a a few bits and bobs of food. And we have a knife and a hatchet now. So I am well equipped. That's a fairly good set of finds early on. I think I might just get rid of that music for the time being. We don't need that, do we? And I'll bring the voice right down. And it's definitely still loud. Hmm, that's probably why. Perhaps I'll bring that further down. forest to our left but I'm going to follow the uh, train tracks to bring me uh, to somewhere you'll always find something following the train tracks here.
so I'm gonna have a look inside. A few useful bits and bobs in the camp office. Can opener, granola bar, tomato soup, bandage. Storm Lantern. Let's have a look in the filing cabinets if we have anything in here. Some beef jerky. Can of soda. And some more beef jerky. Canadians use filing cabinets to store their food. I mean, I wouldn't know, having never been to Canada, but they put their milk in bags, so they seem like a pretty strange bunch. like we've had a pretty good look around here. Yeah. We got a hook and a line so we can make a fishing tackle to do a spot of fishing with. dark in this house. So I hope you can see everything. But let's head outside again. Hmm. I am quite chilly, aren't I? Maybe I should start a fire. of wooden matches. Starting a fire with a book is quite successful. So I'm going to get that going. And then I'll uh, chuck the sticks in. And I'll get myself warmed back up. Maybe I'll have that tomato soup. A nice little victory treat. Finding a place to keep myself alive. I'm here. I can melt and purify some water. So soup get cold. So let's warm that back up.
And there we go. Nice and warm. I'm going to take a torch with me outside. Not for light, but just for additional warmth. And uh, it'll keep wolves at bay. Mr. Wolfie, stay away from me. So we can harvest the cattail plant to use as tinder and as sustenance. to the fishing hut and then probably on to the next fishing hut which will take me over to or in the direction of the lakeside cabins at either end here. to the next one and we'll have a look what we have here We found a, uh, a few more good things here. Mm -hmm. Looks like the wind's picked up, so I think this might blow my torch out. Uh, no. I guess I'm getting lucky here. It is getting quite late in the day though. So I might be heading on down to Sleep Town soon. And finishing off the first day. But I do want to get over to these huts and have a quick check. I 
Let's have a look inside. Nothing in the backpack. Nothing in the crates. Cheeky granola bar in the plastic container. Doesn't look like we have anything else in here, so let's head to the next cabin. And let's make it quick. The weather outside seems to be pretty frightful. So we have some reclaimed wood, which uh, isn't um, particularly good for making fires with. Although, it's not unwelcome. But I have a better source of wood, so. Let's check the third cabin. in here. I might have to uh, light the storm lantern just so I can see what I'm doing here. A flare and beef jerky and that looks like that's going to be the full haul that we have here. Okay. So the weather is fairly awful. Just before I head out, I guess I'll uh, get some drink in me. And let's have a a quick candy bar, just calories, and that puts me in pretty good stead. So let's head on back to the um, camp office before I get too tired and it gets too late. We've got two hours of daylight left, so. Hopefully I can make it over in time. <coughs> Mind you, the, uh, the wind isn't in my favour, so I might have a bit of an issue getting back. When the wind's blowing against you, it does slow you down quite considerably. I'm going to make the journey anyway. Just because I like having a hub to store all my things. Mm. Actually, I'm not sure that leads round. So I'm going to hug the wall here to try and keep out of the wind as much as possible.
this weather is. Definitely not agreeing with me. But gonna keep pushing on through. And uh, we should eventually make it to the camp office. Hopefully in one piece. into a sprint for that last bit. I was getting impatient. Anyway, we are out of the weather. And we are fairly tired. So I think we will call it a day here. jump into bed. Seems like a good a time as any. off the video here. I'm going to keep these videos fairly short but I will make a playlist of them so you can enjoy them one after But um, I'm going to keep each video as a day and uh, yeah I feel like that will be a nice layout to keep them in. Just uh, a day by day thing. So, I'll be finishing off day one soon. Uh, so, yeah, come and join me next time in the Canadian wilderness again of Long Dark. And thank you for watching or just listening as, uh, as I play through. Um, but yeah, see you next time. <laughs>